Hello friends, today's topic is how our skin senses touch, temperature and pain. It's going to be a slightly bigger video than 2 minutes, so please stay back. Layers of the skin have many cutaneous receptors including mechanoreceptors which detect touch, pressure, vibrations, etc. Thermoreceptors which detect temperatures and pain or nociceptors. These receptors are nerve endings and occupy different locations in the skin and body. Mesner's corpuscles are just below the epidermis of the non-hairy glabrous skin of the fingertips and eyelids. Ruffini corpuscles are in deep dermal layers of glabrous skin and subcutaneous tissues. Pacinian corpuscles are in deeper dermis of all skin types. Merkel discs are in the upper layers of skin just below the epidermis of palm, soles, fingers and lips. Cross and bulbs are present in only some sensitive parts of the skin. Hair root plexus are very sensitive nerve endings in hair roots. Free nerve endings are thermoreceptors as well as nociceptors and are located superficially in the skin. Cross and bulbs and Ruffini's corpuscles also act as thermoreceptors. Pacinian corpuscles are encapsulated, the largest, rapidly adapting mechanoreceptors. They sense deep but small duration pressure. They also detect high frequency vibrations in 300 to 400 hertz range. Ruffini endings are encapsulated, spindle shaped and slowly adapting. They detect stretch with high sensitivity and sense gripping of the objects. They help in the awareness and control of muscles and joint position and movement or kinesthetics as it is called. They can also act as warmth receptors. Merkel's discs are unencapsulated, slow adapting. They respond to light touch and allow the estimate of the location of the stimuli. About 25% of the hand receptors are Merkel's disc and are particularly present in the fingertips, lips and external genitalia. Merkel's discs are very sensitive to edges as they generate a continuous response which helps in detecting displacements of less than 1 micrometer of structure and texture. Thus, they are very useful for reading braille and typing on a keyboard. Mesner's corpuscles are fluid-filled, encapsulated neurons at superficial skin locations. They are rapidly acting and respond to fine touch and pressure and low-frequency vibration or flutter. Cross and bulbs are bulbous corpuscles in the superficial skin. They are mechanoreceptors but are also act as thermoreceptors. They are sensitive to cold and get activated by temperature below 20 degrees centigrade. Hair follicles have hair root plexus which can detect light touch. Thermoreceptors can detect warm or cold and cold receptors can temp uh, sense temperatures between 25 to 30 degrees centigrade whereas warm receptors respond to the approximate temperature range of 30 degrees to 46 degrees centigrade. Free nerve endings act as nociceptors or pain receptors. Extremes of temperature, high pressures and tissue damage produce inflammatory markers which bind to nociceptors and initiate pain signaling by opening ion channels and generating action potential. More on that in my next video where I will discuss or how stimuli like pressure or touch open up different ion channels and generate action potentials. Please don't forget to watch. Hope today you could understand how our skin is capable of generating different touch, temperature and pain sensations. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel to get more useful videos and thank you.